If you look up in the dictionary, what does success mean? It's basically achieving an objective or a goal. But if you want to look at it in the way of achieving success in your life overall, I think that's quite an interesting one to figure out. I really think that success should be first asked to yourself. Depending on your values, your life experiences, what really matters to you and what drives you, um, that will kind of determine what is success. All the way through high school I got bullied from everybody. It was, uh, I have to say, quite a tough time of my life. I didn't enjoy it at all. At some point I discovered dance, which gave me freedom and I decided to go to a dance university. And being in dance university, sharing time with people that think the same way and look in the same direction, have the same passion, really saved me. Saved me for myself, saved me from life, and I had a goal to work towards too. So I would say this was one of my bigger personal successes at a, at a young age. I am 21 years old and I have always dreamt of being a singer my entire life but I was always so, so scared of singing in front of people. But I stayed consistent and I finally released a couple of songs. I'm taking myself more serious and I finally have my first performance today. Modeling requires passion, determination, a lot of energy, courage and perseveration. I think rejection is probably the biggest word a dancer knows because uh, like actors and models, everybody has to go through auditions and I would say 99.9% .9 we get rejected, which doesn't give you a very good feeling and the self-esteem just drops all the way. Growing up, I was striving to get success in the modeling industry and sometimes I would work with people who weren't so great and who I know weren't behaving very well behind the scenes and working with those people really made me feel ill and it made me feel ill to think that I supported these people and it wasn't until I pulled away from people like that and actually started speaking out about these kind of people that I started to feel more fulfilled and I started to feel better with myself and get in touch with who I truly was, truly am. Seeing small improvements even if they're not the biggest, even if you're not exactly where you want to be today or tomorrow shows that you are on track and you are successful. I always try to fit in and kind of live up to the expectations of the people running the auditions and it never quite seemed to work until I discovered that the thing I had to do is to just be myself and believe in myself. Staying true to my values is something that brings me overall fulfillment. When you will only consider it personally as a success, then everyone else will consider it too. A lot of us grow up with celebrity culture, with um, peer and social pressure to achieve certain things. Is really something that is a dream for many people. I think it can take a while for us to unlearn some of the stuff that we grow up um, seeing being an example of success. If you want to be successful, you start today. You become successful today. And you know that in your heart, you are a successful person. Believe in yourself and allow yourself to be different because only with being yourself, you will be understood and loved and valued especially. If I find success, in my modeling or acting career and I don't feel good about myself going to bed at night, then what's the point? I realized that over the years, taking my time and setting goals and slowly achieving them and growing actually helped shape me. I think it's important to sometimes slow down and say, what is a success to me overall? Personal success, professional success, it does go hand in hand. It's not always easy to get, but once you get there, Life gives you champagne instead of lemons.